Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Shira and I post planner related videos on this channel. So today I do have my birthday plan with me up for you guys. Um, my birthday was several, several weeks ago. Um, this is the week of January 14th through 20th. It did take me a while. Um, my birthday was the 19th. It took me a while to really get this up and going. Um, I was obviously busy during my birthday weekend or my birthday week in general. And then I also had a lot of plans the week after. So I am using the January Mystery Ultimate Kit from Scribble Prints Co. This is not this past January's, like the 2019 January. This is from January of 2018, I believe. I remember seeing this last year and it was already around my birthday because obviously my birthday is in January. And I wasn't subscribed to the um, mystery kit quite yet. So I actually ended up picking this up while I was in Austin for the SBC party. So that was really awesome to be able to get that. So I did just quickly put the um, all the setup up, the flags, the um, date covers, and then the bottom washi. I'm mainly using a lot of this kit because there is a lot of stuff in it. I did kind of go through the pages with you guys. Um, and I don't want to put it to waste. I mean, I'm obviously going to have some leftovers after this whole thing. But I do want to use as much of it as I possibly can. So I tried to really not pull in as many elements as I normally would. Especially like, say, if I had a mini kit going. So here on Monday, I put down a half box. And then this couple sticker is from Happy Dia Stickers. Um, it was me and my boyfriend's like month anniversary, so I just put that down. We don't really do anything for them anymore because it's been so long, but I just mark them to mark them at this point, honestly. The sticker that I used to um, mark working from home is from Paper Kumiko. That is Momo the Cat. That Boba sticker is from Grid and Barrett. Um, so this week it was really busy like the first half was pretty okay And then the latter half was really busy because of my birthday Just a bunch of like random dinners and all that with friends, but it was really fun. So I really did get to use um, a Good amount of stickers in this kit, but I definitely still had a lot of leftovers I know some of you have recommended that I give away my leftovers um I just find it to be a lot of work. I would love to do that, but I feel like I'm already so inconsistent with uploading my videos that I figured I'd just give it to local people. I go to meetups once a month. Well, whenever I'm actually here, I seem to be missing them most of the time lately, but I do bring them there. Maybe one of these days I'll do it if I become more consistent with planning my weeks and filming them. Maybe I'll do a giveaway at some point. I think that's a great idea though because... I don't know, someone else probably would rather use it. Um, so on Monday, the bottom sticker, the upload one, is from my shop. And then the plate and spoon is from Very Cute Designs. The top of Tuesday, I had a sticker from, um, I think that was from Happy Dye Stickers. Yep. And then the coffee cup is from Doodles Do Co. So for this part, I just used two little things because I don't really use a lot of them and I wanted a solid color like washi background. So I did just cover it up with an icon from Happy Daya. Um, I did still pull in some like activity stickers. Like I said, trying to use as much of the stickers in here as possible. So I did use some of the circle icons as well. Oh, and aside from my birthday being this week, I had a bunch of friends that also had birthdays this week. So they were all marked down in my planner. I tried to use the same sticker to mark each person. So I did just use a um, glitter header that I, I wasn't really using glitter headers anyways. So I just put people's names on there and noted that it was their birthday. I didn't have a juice sticker, which I have a couple in mind that I would pick up to do that. Which I do get juice, um, like green juices and stuff like that relatively often. So because it was green juice, I just used this like kind of matcha sticker from Happy Daya stickers. I used a lot of Happy Daya this week, actually. Um, these couple stickers that I'm showing right now, the laptop as well as the YouTube binge stickers are from a shop that's no longer open. On the bottom, I was trying to mark down foiling some orders, but I didn't really have like a mink or um, whatever machine sticker. So I just used a silhouette sticker and that was from Paper Kumiko. 
Really quickly, I just wanted to put down the weekend banner just so I could plan out where other things could go and kind of before I forget because I feel like weekend banners are something that I would forget so easily. Um, here, um, another birthday. Literally, I think the 16th, the 17th, and the 18th, I had people who had birthdays and this wasn't even each person that had a birthday yet. So I was debating to figure out which stickers I wanted to have on my actual birthday. So I was debating between having the girl or the dog, but I, I can't remember which one I actually end up picking. Um, the meeting sticker that is above the frame right now, that is from Toffee Bananas, and then that is a munchkin. Um, I put another one in the beginning of the week. The original munchkin, which was on Monday, came with the kit. It was one of the freebie like little sheets that came with it. And then I pulled one out from my collection, which I happen to have the same kind. That um, sticker with the middle finger was from, oh my god, I'm totally blanking out, Fox and Cactus. Yeah. And then the salad sticker is again from Happy Daya stickers. I think I used a lot of Happy Daya this week because it's my birthday week and I feel like birthdays, you go out to eat a lot. So yeah. And I use a lot of munchkins here too, it seems. Yeah, so I thought this kit was super cute. I really love the theme of it. It's like pinks and peaches and golds. And while like peaches and like golds aren't necessarily my favorite, I just think it's such a cool like color scheme to have for birthday kits. I know a lot of them end up being like pinkish already, but I don't know, I just really liked it. I remember when I first saw it last year, I really wanted it and I was really lucky enough to be able to find it during the SBC party. That sticker for CPK, which is California Pizza Kitchen, if you're not familiar, that is from the Smushed Peach. That is an emoji for leg day. I really love that one. It's the butts one. Um, that is from the Coffee Monsters Co. That's another emoji, the dizzy one, because I was hangry that day. And then at the very bottom, that's a hot pot sticker from Happy Diet Stickers. We went to a unlimited all-you-can-eat hot pot place. That's why I was kind of hangry before it, because we had to go at a certain hour because it was happy hour, I think. So I was trying to figure out how to mark my birthday, but I used one of these stickers, which is... Um, Momo, which I've already used earlier in the week as well. I think I've used Momo a couple of times in this spread now. Um, but so it's just Momo, kind of happy, and then I put down that I'm 23. So here I was debating between which stickers to put down when. And so I did use this sticker, which is the girl holding a balloon. She's kind of cut off. I ended up using the same girl at the beginning of the week on this sidebar because I wanted them to kind of match. But so here I was trying to figure out which events I wanted to mark down. So one thing that my coworkers and I did this day was we went to Raised by Wolves, which is a speakeasy in San Diego. Um, if you're not familiar with what a speakeasy is, that is a bar that is kind of hidden. So on the outside, it may not look like a bar. It's one of those things where you have to know that it's a bar and you'll have to enter through some odd way. But so this place, we had to sit in some chairs and they turned the wall around on us. So we would go into the bar that way. It was really cool. And I really loved how my hand lettering turned out in that part. I thought it was really awesome. Um, this burger sticker is from Fox and Pip. And before going to Race by Wolves, we went to a place called Eureka. I think it's pretty much everywhere. I'm not really sure, but it's a burger place. And then at the end of the night, I did mark down that we did um, Korean karaoke, which if you're not familiar with Korean style karaoke, it's a little different where you have a room to yourself and you get to just, you know, sing with your friends. It's not as embarrassing as going up to the stage to like sing in front of a bunch of people. But yeah. So the next day I did put down the dog sticker. I really love that. I was really, really debating on using it for my birthday. Um, I did do a lot of things still on Sunday, um, pretty much this whole weekend. And the next day was also a holiday. So then I got to do a bunch of things with different friends. Um, a lot of these are Happy Daya, Once More With Love, um, the Coffee Monsters Co. And that medicine bottle, I actually do not know what that shop is anymore. I picked that up from a stash that happened like I don't know, a year or two ago at a San Diego planner meetup. Like I said, we do have monthly meetups, so I try to just bring my D-stashes there. But yeah, I'll definitely consider doing like a giveaway with my leftovers at some point. So I'm, I just put down some of the deco because there was a lot, and then I'm going to go through which things I still have left. See, there's just so much of this still left. Um, I don't think I'm going to give this one away just yet, um, but I am going to do some cleaning. I'm going to condo out my condo which is funny 
Um, and I'm going to try to see if there's enough to maybe give away. We'll see about that. But yeah, this is my spread for my birthday. I really enjoyed filming this plan with me. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it as well. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.